And your questions that have come in from members of the public. Darren says, six years on, what is your Brexit highlight? Uh, for me, oh, I think, personally, the final speech in the European Parliament, waving the flags and that horrible, sour-faced old bag cutting off the microphone. I thought, <laughs> yeah, we're right to leave. <laughs> Mike asks, how can we leave the ECHR and still protect the Good Friday Agreement? Mike, we haven't got long for this. I feel, Peter, the time has come. I, th I think the ECHR is completely out of date. I think the way that Blair wrote ECHR into the Good Friday Agreement that it is like a poison pill. Is this too difficult to handle or should we do it? Well, if it is written into the Good Friday Agreement, we shouldn't withdraw, certainly not in this parliament. But I'm told actually it isn't, because the Good Friday Agreement refers to human rights legislation. The Human Rights Act hadn't then been passed. Yes. And actually we probably, so I'm told by a senior lawyer, that we could actually leave. OK. But then again, I guess, isn't the answer really, when you've got political will, you can do pretty much anything? You can, but there are, we ought to be very careful about doing anything that would disturb the Good Friday Agreement that's the what's so wrong with the Northern Ireland Protocol and why we're overriding is, it. Is it would it be a bit that, odd to sort yeah. of okay. unbalance it. A well, bit. We're but I, I think we can <coughs> do it without it. We're going to come back to ECHR on this programme again and again and again.